Let's set the mood. I'll even give you a button too. Take a deep breath though. Let's talk front end. I don't have a bad front end either, right? Front end is all the stuff that makes the web look and feel sexy. We're talking stuff like HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. This is your HTML. This is your HTML in the browser. And this is your HTML and CSS. Like LSD for your web page. Any questions? Yeah, baby. HTML just isn't that sexy by itself. So CSS makes it easy to change things like font size and color. CSS3 and HTML5 are the newest versions of HTML and CSS and are so hot right now. So hot right then we've got now. JavaScript. Every modern browser has JavaScript built in and it lets you do all kinds of cool stuff. JavaScript is kind of a pain in the ass to write. So people use JavaScript libraries like jQuery to make it easier. The JavaScript world is changing fast too for two reasons. CSS3 and HTML5 are starting to do a lot of cool things JavaScript used to do. Plus there's new JavaScript frameworks and platforms like Backbone and Node.js that are taking the language to the next level. Now, you can start putting all this together by yourself, but that's reinventing the wheel. There are already frameworks and CMS systems to get a site up and running really fast. For the front end, there's HTML5 boilerplate and bootstrap that include all the best practice HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. If you wanted a backend framework, you can use Ruby on Rails, Django for Python, and all kinds of different ones for PHP, like Yeet or Zend. Or you can use a CMS. CMS stands for Content Management System. Two of the most popular ones are WordPress and Drupal. They're both written with PHP, but provide you pretty much with everything you need out of the box to make a simple website with only a little knowledge of HTML, CSS, and PHP. Just explore your options. There's always something out there to make your life easier. Easy is good. Remember, great programmers are lazy and never do more work than is necessary. Next, we'll talk about the tools you'll need on your computer to become the next internet bajillionaire like Zuckerberg.